I hope you're well and you've had a good day. I trust you have in Jesus' name and that you're well and you're safe. Um, I wanted to share today. Um, from Psalm 57, it says, Be gracious to me, O God. Be gracious and merciful to me. For my soul finds shelter and safety in you. Hallelujah. And in the shadow of your wings, I will take refuge and be confidently secure until destruction passes by. And in also in Psalm fifty, uh, sorry, Psalm ninety one, it talks about how the Lord says, uh, for see, the Lord says, uh, for He will give His angels a special charge over you, to accompany and defend and guard you, in all your ways of obedience and service. And I just want to encourage you today to know that the Lord is our shelter, He's our safety, and that our angels are around us. And I wanted to give a testimony as well. Um, so be encouraged to know that the Lord is. You know, he's stationed his angels as a child of God. When you come to the Lord and you repent and you give your heart to Jesus, when you look to him and you say, Lord, I'm looking to you to look after my family. I'm looking to you to look after my husband, my family, my uh, children, and, you know, everything concerning you. And you've given your heart to the Lord. The Lord promises that he will give angels to God for us and keep us and deliver us and keep us safe from danger. And and this is and this psalm is talking about a prayer for rescue from from uh, persecutors, um, and it says here to the chief musician, set to the tune of "Do Not Destroy," a mictum of David, a record of memorable thoughts of David when he fled from Saul in the in the cave, and so. You know, he's talking about how you know, the Lord is protecting him under the shadow of his wings and keeping him safe. And he's praising the Lord and I'm going to praise the Lord. And in your own time, if you will read uh, Psalm 57, it's an amazing psalm, if you will. If you'd read it, with deep, you know, you'd really you know, enjoy reading that. It's an amazing psalm. And of how uh, David talks about that protection and praising the Lord and, and it's uh, thanking God for, for his protection. And so um, I'll give a quick testimony. When I was, uh, actually recently, um, when my husband and I were in the uh, park, we were just in the park having a day out and we took a photo. And in that photo, and this is not just for me, by the way, everybody has angels because the Lord promises us that we have in Psalm 91. So it's not just for me. Um, so he took the photo. And you saw the angel wings really clearly. At first, we, at first we thought it was a distortion of the picture, but it wasn't. It was a, it was an angel's wings around me and and by the pram, and it was caught on camera and it blew us away. Uh, I never, I've never experienced anything like that before. Never saw it on on camera before. And the Lord allowed that, and it really encouraged me because in that moment. I was wafting things away in the park and like dodging things and it was like all oh, gnats and things. And and the and it's like, you know, in that moment, it's amazing how my husband took a photo and it's like you know, the Lord just saying again, I'm here. I'm here. And when we saw that, like I said, I've never experienced anything like it before, but it really encouraged me. And I hope it encourages you too, because that's the same for you as a child of God. Whether we see our angels or not, we have them. And so uh, that's what happened, and that's what the Lord did, and I give thanks to God. And, you know, just be encouraged today to know that the Lord is with you. He is taking care of you, just as he promises he will. When he says that, you, you know, he'll, he'll keep you safe under the shadows, in the shadow of his wings. Like it says here, for my soul finds shelter and safety in you. And in the shadow of your wings, I will take refuge and be confidently secure. And be confidently secure. Because when we go through things in life, you know, we, we're human, we sometimes get a little, like, scared or, you know, we get weary and, you know, so it's good to, to know this promise from God really encourages me as well. And all of us, I hope it encourages you too, to know that the Lord, when he says he's our shelter and safety, that he will be not just for you and me, but for our families, for our children, for our loved ones, you know, he's there, he is there. So be encouraged to know the Lord is with you no matter what you're going through. He is there. Let's pray. Lord, thank you that you are so faithful, Lord, and that you are with us. Thank you, Lord, that you are so faithful and that you never leave us, Lord. And you love us even when we go astray, you gently put us back on track. Help us, Lord, to continue to, to seek you in prayer, to look to you and give our family into your hands, Lord. As we seek you, as we seek your will for our lives, in Jesus' name we pray.